Hey, this is Rama from Creations Landscape Designs, Earth Friendly Landscapes. So I'm here at a backyard, and I'll show you the front yard next in Mission Viejo, another garden in Mission Viejo. In this case, we gutted most of the front and back and restarted from scratch. These are two olive trees that we planted. The homeowners liked olives, so we kept them. This was a flagstone patio that the contractor installed which looks really nice. What was here was a square concrete pad that was about a third the size of this. So this is much better. Some plantings here, a lot of yellow. Some coast sunflower, more sun drops. Howard McMinn Manzanita. An existing bird of paradise that we kept. This is their garden shed with their garden tools and some storage. This pine tree, which they call Pete the Pine, was already here. This gravel path leads to the backyard. Or leads from the backyard to the shed. And then these little... I don't even know what the proper term for these are. They were stacked behind the shed and we reused them as edging. Some more sun drops. Some Baja Bush Snapdragon, Autumn Sage. Red Penstemon. Some existing plants back there we kept. Eventually the homeowners are going to get a fancy pants table and chair system. But after doing this garden, they decided to financially breathe, breathe a little bit. So then in this side yard, we kept these plants. The homeowners wanted to keep them. Here we also did a flagstone pathway. We have some coyote mint here, and Cilia Californica Coast Sunflower, which we also had in the back. This is a Tacoma. It has kind of a yellowish, orangish, mauveish flower. Here also we added flagstone all the way up to the front walk. This flagstone is called Oklahoma Bugskin or Butternut which is available at Resource Building Materials in Lake Forest. Some more sages here. This is Salvia Gregii Moonlight. Light yellow autumn sage. Homeowners did add a lantana, which is perfectly fine. They liked it, so they added it. Red penstemon here. Ah, there it is. Flower of the Tacoma. They also redid the driveway. And then they did keep some grass in the front because they really wanted to keep some grass, so we kept some grass. This garden, however, is doing really nice. Homeowner said about Maybe three or four plants croaked, which they replaced. And then we made the driveway mostly concrete and then did a banding around it of the flagstone. And then this area was pre-existing, but we didn't touch it. Homeowners didn't want to mess with it because it's half, there's half the neighbors. So if you liked this video, please feel free to share it comment below with any questions you might have. Like it if you liked it. And if you need a sustainable landscape and want to learn how to kill your lawn and increase your property value, ask me how. This is Rama with Creation Landscape Designs or Friendly Landscapes. Over and out.